guys, it's Kelly. I wanted to drop in today and share with you my January main kit from Citrus Twist. This is my second video and I'm actually recording on my laptop instead of my cell phone, so I'm hoping this comes out a little bit better. Um, hopefully you can see me okay. I was having some issues with the light dancing um, all over the place because the sun is out and it's actually behind the laptop. So I think I figured it out. So hopefully it is okay. So here is what I'll be sharing with you. January main kit from Citrus Twist. The box that the kit comes in, which is this. It's very protected. I love how it's wrapped so that way nothing gets hurt. None of the good products. And this is what the kit comes in, this craft wrapping paper bag. And here's a look at everything that came in the kit. This is just the main kit. Um, and I will go through and show you the products that I received. This kit is called You Are My Sunshine January Kit. All of the kits come with this inspiration sheet, which is just projects created by the design team. Just gives you some inspiration and ideas to use um, for the January kit. And of course, I will start with a pattern paper because I love pattern paper. The first pattern paper is from Studio Calico Print Shop. It is this beautiful ombre rainbow scallop circle. I really, really love this. I'm excited to use it. If you look pretty close, it looks like it's a little bit distressed already, which I think is pretty cool. And then on the back is this graph paper. The second page is this triangle geometric shapes um, and this is the front this is the this says this is the life and here it says sweet happy little moments and this paper is from chic tags so it has a little bit of watercolor on here which i really really love i think this would be great as a background paper I think that would be really awesome. And this is the third sheet. This is from Crate Paper. Um, it has these crochet looking hearts on it, if you can see up close. And then in the back is just little hearts. And then actually there's like a old vintage looking tape here up in the corner, which I think is pretty cool. So that's what that one looks like. The third one is by Studio Calico, the fourth one, sorry, is by Studio Calico. It has these ampersands all over it, which I think is really, really awesome. I think the ampersand sign has been in for a while. And I love, love, love this side. Um, this is um, called And Then. And I really, really love this. This reminds me a lot of like Allie Edwards types and everyone is doing like the painting handwriting kind of effect and if I could scrapbook with only black and white I would so I'm like insanely in love with that. Um, this one is by Fancy Pants Designs. Um, the back is just a gray wood grain like a wood looking and then this side has um, this is called Old Flame and it has a bunch of polka dots and then there's this cute little heart up here in the corner. So I really, really love that one. This one is by Sheep Tags also. And this is just like a notebook paper, but it has like coffee stains on it to make it look like it's stained. And on the back is like another wood paneling. This reminds me of a house I grew up on because we had wood paneling like this. It's kind of funny. Um, this one is from Pebbles, Yours Truly. And it has these super, super fun arrows. Really, really love those. And then more hearts. Of course, this is going to be themed towards Valentine's Day, but I really love hearts. So it kind of works out nice. This is from the Studio Calico Print Shop collection 
also chalkboard oh my gosh chalkboard is so in right now and look at these little tags like these would be perfect to cut out and actually use like on its own background paper instead I really really love this and um, on the back is just the striped it's almost like an aqua maybe you can see it and then there's just a couple little like types on here a couple little different sayings so that's what that one looks like and then the cardstock that it comes with there's four pieces of cardstock in here um, this is just a craft cardstock this is like a golden yellow type um, it's not very transitioning well here on the laptop let me see um, but it's actually like a let's try that it's actually like a golden yellow type um, this is like an aqua marine color the colors really aren't showing up as well as I hope they would and this is kind of like an off-white um, it looks white down here but it actually is like an off-white and the more I do this on my laptop I will try to adjust the colors I apologize like I said this is my first time recording this on here and I wasn't really sure how it was going to transition but I just wanted to give it a shot so that was the pattern paper and now I will show you the embellishments that came in the kit. The first is these puff balls from Fresh Cut. They call them pom poms, but I always used to call them puff balls. Um, these are from Basic Gray, and that's what those look like. These totally remind me of my mom because she used to have a sweater with all of these on there, and you know, kind of like back in like the 80s or early. 90s when these used to be cool so I'm kind of interested to see how it's going to be when I use those um, these are die cut shapes from Studio Calico I really really love these a lot of them look like they're vellum um, and here's what it looks like on the back so I'm really excited to use those um, October afternoon is one of my favorite manufacturer so I'm really excited to have this this is from daily flash just a bunch of clouds and um, like little raindrops are in here I really really love those and those are chipboards so they're kind of thicker and then speaking of thicker we got these American crafts thickers and these are um, called print shop here's what they look like they're kind of like a deeper um like red um it's showing here more pink but they're actually kind of like a little bit more red like a darker red and it's really cool because it has this type of finishing on here already um let's see if i can show that to you and it's almost like painted white um which i think is pretty cool so here's what those look like and here is another little bag that has more embellishments in it. Yay! More embellishments. Usually Citrus Twist has their own stamp um, that they give every month and um, it's their own stamp not like through any company. They, It's actually um, says made in the USA 2013 Citrus Twist so it is their own clear stamp and here is what this month's stamp looks like. It has the you are my sunshine this says it's the simple things you and me there's an and sign there and then little darling my wild one let's do this crazy for you and make it happen so that's what those look like and usually they try to include like a hand crafted vintage embellishment and this is what this month's is I really really love this I'm usually not crazy about butterflies but I'm really excited to use these it's on this thread and then it just has like these little butterflies that look like they were cut out of like a book or dictionary paper so those are going to be really interesting to use Citrus Twist also does their own wood chips um, 
in the kit and this is this month's if you see here it says they're made by star and b and this is just clouds and raindrops um, I have used these in the past and they are pretty sturdy. I've had one or two of them break, but um, usually they are pretty thick. Um, this is Embellishments Happy Place by Chic Tags. And it's just a bunch of little journaling tags. And here's what it looks like on the back. And this is the washi tape that came in the kit this month. Usually one roll of washi tape is always um, included in the kit. This is an orange washi tape. And if you, let me see if I can show you, there's like a little flower design on here. Um, I wanna try and see if you guys can see that. There you go. So it's this really pretty little flower design. Um, that's what that looks like. And I really love this orange color. I hardly ever use orange for um, my scrapbooking, so I'm really excited. And then it came with this little black bean bag. And I haven't opened this one yet, so we get to see it at the same time. Um, inside is just... Sorry, I don't want to make too much noise out here. Um, inside is just some sequins, some colored sequins, and some orange thread. Here's the orange thread. And let's see if I can show you the sequins without spilling them all over the floor. There they are. They're, oops, <laughs> they're like a blue slash pink color. Um, almost like a coral. And let's see, of course I dropped some on the floor. Let's see if you can see inside the bag. You can see there's there is a bunch in there. So that is what came in my Citrus Twist main kit. In the past they did include um, a stamp pad but they did away with that starting in January so that way they can include more embellishments which I'm totally fine with because I honestly need more embellishments than I need more stamp pads. So I did look at the add-on kits. They do have add-ons, but I didn't um, think I liked any of them enough to really purchase them. I thought they were all great, but I'm trying to only purchase what I think I really, really love and might use. Um, there are add-ons if you'd like to purchase them. They have a stamp add-on. They have um, just a pattern paper add-on, just an embellishment add-on. Um, and then if you're thinking about trying the Citrus Twist kits, the cost of my kit, um, I am on a six month subscription. The cost of my kit was um, $30.50. So you get a lot of stuff for $30.50, I think. And um, it's $7.95 for shipping. So for a total of $38.45. So I think that's a really good price. Citrus Twist Kits are really the only new products I get to play around with because we are on a budget. So I really enjoy getting this each month. I think it's definitely worth the $38. It comes with a lot. I can make a lot. And I really enjoy everything I got. And since the weather has been so chilly out here, I'm really excited to play with some of those bright colors. So this is my second video, and I hope you liked it. And sorry about the mess-ups. I promise I'll get better. And thanks for watching. Bye.